Thing stopped through the English Channel. Mm -hmm. uh, you know this very, very well. Yep. You had exactly the same problem in Australia. The difference was the distance to Indonesia was slightly bigger, mm -hmm. the boats were bigger, the numbers per boat was bigger. But yeah. The principles were all exactly the same. And you mm -hmm. are the man that solved it. And you did it being condemned by the United Nations, the European Union. You know, I mean, global abuse was thrown at Tony Abbott, mm -hmm. but you solved the problem. Does the British Conservative Party have the muscle to do this? Well, in the end, and I'm talking now about Australia. Yes. Uh, in the end, you have got to have the will to do it. And the problem was the previous government didn't have the will to do it. And I can remember going into a very early meeting of uh, very senior officials with heavy responsibilities in this area. And I was told um, we might risk serious conflict with Indonesia, mm -hmm. to which I said, well, so be it. Uh, if boats were coming from Australia to Indonesia, do we think for a second that the Indonesians would hesitate in taking the strongest possible action to stop these boats? Um, and serious countries do not allow themselves to be taken advantage of by, in this case, criminal gangs who are smuggling people in for all sorts of nefarious purposes, as well as, yes, yeah. people who just genuinely want a better life. So, so we had the will, we had a plan, uh, we adjusted the plan uh, where necessary, when the people smugglers kept scuttling the, their boats, uh, preventing the turnbacks that we wanted to do, uh, we gave uh, them unsinkable boats which we towed uh, to within um, a mile or so of Indonesia's yeah. waters with just enough fuel to get back to Indonesia and off they went. Now um, this is not the Timor Sea, the English Channel is not the Timor Sea, Indonesia is not France but one way or another uh, the British government just has to say that the way is closed and uh, I am I think the Rwanda deal uh, was certainly a big step in the right direction. It's a real pity um, that uh, uh, the legal work had not been done uh, mm. to avoid the jurisdiction of that European court. Well, but I, under uh, but I understand yeah. there are steps in train uh, to avoid yeah, anything There's, there's like a bit of unfinished business. Mm. No, there really is. But what you did is an inspiration mm. to many, many, many of us.